should not care if there is no scientific proof that semen retention works and why it does work and, and I'm going to get into basically and this is just not about semen retention basically with all all these things out here about different sciences new sciences and this and that you gotta understand how to how to learn elemental science for yourself uh, what's supposed to call common sense even common knowledge got to understand how to decipher things because they understand that we're in a society where people are very dependent on information that's disseminated and they manipulate information. Now, the thing is you have to understand as well with semen retention is that it's not, it's not just a physical thing you can measure. It's a spiritual thing. Um, it's, it's, it's the scripture says that the things that are, the things that are spiritual cannot be received through the carnal mind okay and though it is some physical aspects that can't be measured the overall thing is is that it's a spiritual experience it's about conserving your sexual energy and the spirit and the physical tie-in together you know i talk a lot about that um also you have to understand is that when you hear things like new science always be weary of that there's nothing new under the sun you can discover things that you haven't been discovered but there's no things don't not necessarily change and manipulate a lot of the science you see out here or so-called new science or studies are studies that are paid for manipulated they want you to stay in the matrix they want you to stay inoculated and sedated through the drugs it's called the food and drug administration because the food and the drugs are one <laughs> they are one um the, the, the food that we get is full of drugs there's nothing organic even the so-called organic food it's not fully organic so we have to understand what we're up against thankfully by the grace of the most high that um, we're able to still if we're doing the best we can we still can be rewarded as if we were eating from totally clean no no one actually is in america outside the country that may be in america let's get right into it so we talk about things about semen retention and talk about the, the benefits of testosterone the benefits of uh female attraction or the benefits of clarity your clarity of mind focus things of that nature we all know those we all know those benefits the benefits of you know basically resetting resetting yourself back to your to your boyhood state or or man you know resetting yourself to where you can be, be reintroduced to enjoying things better get a better you know fulfillment out of life you're not so focused on sex so much that you're that you're because when you're focused on sex and you're focused on, especially when you have a porn addiction or even a sexual addiction you, you don't enjoy life as much because your whole life is centered around busting the nut your whole life is centered around getting the, getting the orgasm off when you actually in semen retention i'm going to tell you i still have sex at times when i do bust it to produce a child um but when you have when you having sex or semen retention and you're practicing it you actually enjoy sex a lot more you actually enjoy sex a lot more as a giver, as a man, and a woman coming, and you coming yourself, and you get deep into it. But the thing is, you gotta understand, when you see, when they say, there's no science for proof of this, or no proof of that, or no proof of this, don't worry about what they say. Worry about how you react. Test it for yourself. That's number one. Test it for yourself. Test it for yourself. See how it works. Really give it a true effort. Some of you may notice it, some of you may not, but the majority of people who do it in earnest receive those benefits of semen retention. Those who don't, they all, those who fall off or, or they go into it for the wrong reasons or they don't translate 
manipulate that energy don't see it you can't just the first first off you gotta understand that senior retention is it isn't just about building up a streak and things of that nature that's cool you can have a, a, a million day streak you can have a hundred day streak it don't matter 90 or whatever if you're not taking that energy and putting it into putting it back out there that you that you're saving that energy that you're saving and you're seeing brother if you're not taking that energy and being creative with it or taking your energy and using it towards something towards rebuilding your life towards towards other things then you're not gonna you're not you're gonna think that nothing's happening you have to first of all transfer that energy you can't just let that energy just sit there you gotta do something with it you gotta you gotta be about your purpose with that energy. So another thing is too back to the science thing don't get discouraged by them saying that because for one thing like i said a lot of these scientists are bought and paid for just put the elements together and then you decide for yourself now we know they'll say oh well you know you can get blue balls you know you hear the niggas that says all the they are they, it's a lot of it's a lot of doctrine out here to try to discourage you from getting some attention because porn they make so much money off of porn but they don't even really have to charge for porn to make money because porn keeps a lot of ideologies going in society porn keeps us over sexualized it keeps us uh over 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 dope we, we we get we get so addicted to dopamine hits at least in the other habits like sugar like weight like uh like a lot like a lot of it does, it's not just about sex at least in the bad habits and bad periods you don't have you don't control your sexual energy that bleeds into other aspects of your life that's why you see a lot of guys who masturbate a lot also are out of shape are also not focused also don't have any goal any real goals or, or a plan so they know what they're doing they want to keep us all zombies and keep us all slay that's why it's important to break from the matrix and take back your hold of your masculinity first of all you can just look up elemental things because if you google stuff google manipulate it it's not going to tell you the truth so just look up the elements is there testosterone in my semen is there nutrients in my semen just just research basic semen oh lo and behold there is there is nutrients there is things in my semen oh wow so you search for that part independent. So take that now. It's now just a common sense thing. If am I going to benefit more by giving these nutrients and these and these and these things out of my body constantly, or keeping it for myself and storing it? Hmm. What do you think? Of course, you're going to benefit more by keeping it. Just as just as if if you had a, a, a if you had a bottle of water. Is your body going to benefit more by drinking the water and keeping it inside or taking the water and pouring the body of the water on the ground? It's going to benefit more by you putting that and keeping that within your body. Your body can use the same thing with your semen. If there's if there's good things in semen, if you keep it inside, it's going to benefit you. Now, we all have to ejaculate at some point. I'm not saying keep it forever, but you just want to. We have a certain amount of times our body's actually built to ejaculate. And, and, and it deals with our vitality as men. So the, the, the least you ejaculate, the more vi vitality you keep within yourself, the more you're able to keep your youth or keep your skin, you know, there's things that benefit with your skin, with uh, you, uh, semen retention, there's benefit with, with youthful looks. People like them think I'm a lot younger than what I am, not knowing that I'm a man that has kids in college. Um, so it's a lot of benefits to it otherwise as well that you won't see unless you try you can't let things if you feel now i'm not saying and this is not for everybody it's not an easy journey but it is an easy journey once you get into that rhythm once you understand what you transmit it out it's, it's power in our seed man our seed once we let that seed out of our body we lose all control that woman can do whatever she wants with that seed even though it's our seed the laws are set up against us. We not the laws are not friendly towards our city once it leaves our body. We pretty much lose all control. I mean, pretty much. The only control that we have is whatever we work out with that woman. That's just pretty much how society is set up. It's messed up is like that way. I'm not if you got our woman in, even if you got your woman in check or dominion of your woman or whatever, she still has she still has the laws of society in her back pocket. So it's about wisely, wisely selecting. Even though I haven't, things haven't worked out perfectly with the women I have children with all at all times. I have good relationships with them, and for the most part. And also, I was able to because I wasn't. It wasn't random chicks. I was able to pick good mothers for my children and good mates that would be best fit. And no one's gonna be perfect, but I was able to pick what was best fit 
and my kids are beautiful and amazing. And when you're your, 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 your semen, your, the quality of your sperm is higher. The kids that if you do have, if you have kids with your kids, I mean, my kids are like, I'm not just saying, like people say stuff to their kids, they want to care about their kids. Trust me, it's, people see it all over. My kids have special glow, they got special intelligence, instincts is, is higher than most other kids. Um, they're very, very special, and you can see that they're different in a great way. And I and, and it's it's a difference between them and kids I had not this is the kids I didn't have a student teacher, I love them, they're great too, they're smart too and all that, but they the ones I had on it, man, it's just a different level. Um and you gotta understand that you only experience these things by trying out, by experimenting. And like I said, take the elements of things and put them together and just ask yourself certain questions instead of trying to Google things all the time and see this. You have to Google, you can find stuff on Google still that's good, but you gotta know what you're Googling for. And understand Google is very biased towards the agendas that are put in society, towards every agenda that's pushed by the media, that's pushed by Hollywood. Google is gonna be very biased towards that. And they do not want you to stop masturbating. They want you to masturbate. They try to put, oh, masturbate. The benefits of masturbation and all of that, first of all, you can get those same benefits that they put in masturbation without busting the nerve. Just in reach it. There's ways. I'm gonna get more into the sexual kind of food controlling your orgasm. Still, you can still orgasm on female retention, fellas. You still can have orgasms, okay? Just if you wanna hold that nut and keep that essence, keep that energy, keep that, keep that the blessing of Abraham as it's called inside your bosom. Alright, alright, fellas. So with that being said, it's all I'm saying, stay encouraged. And remember, if you fall, just keep going, man. Don't, don't, you didn't lose because you get discouraged, you think you lost it all, and all, and I know that feeling. You just get right back on the horse and keep riding, all right? Um, you know, and learn your intervals. Some of you may not need to go as long. Some of you may only need seven days at a time. And, you know, you got to learn yourself. Know that, you know, so-called science and all these things put you in a situation where you're dependent on other information. The best teacher of your body is you. The best, the best learning experience you can learn from is the experience that you experience with experiment with your own body overall now you can get advice on, on parameters on how to do it safely and all of that but you're going to learn the best way to help yourself is through you and with senior retention that is something that is going to give each man a different impact though there are overall great benefits that most will experience each man is going to have certain different experiences with that so you want to make sure that don't knock it till you try. Don't just read comments and do this and watch videos and think that, oh man, oh you know it may not be for me or this is bullshit. No, if you ain't really actually, you ain't if you ain't never went at least if you ain't went at least thirty to thirty to sixty days of super retention, it's really you're really not gonna understand it. You gotta go at, at minimum now. I say at least sixty to ninety, but at least thirty days at a minimum before you give a qualified opinion. With that being said, I'm out, family. Peace, love, life. Be sure to subscribe, like the video, subscribe, share, um, comment. You know, it's appreciated. All that's appreciated. Much love. Peace.